popular demand um, my bed rating skills um, this is a very comfortable bed what can I say so fluffy let me come closer to you so yeah in the beginning of this I didn't really feel like talking and I'm feeling a quite a bit better so I just wanted to kind of give you an update on what we're even doing why are we here what's going on other than one time I went to um, Kyoto uh, with my mom. That was kind of the only time I've ever traveled for cherry blossoms but this trip this trip is for the cherry blossoms and what a gamble it is um to try and guesstimate like they just all come out overnight the days leading up to this trip i was like man i don't think there are gonna be any i don't really know and then lo and behold the day before my feed erupts with pictures of cherry blossoms so i was like oh thank god but anyway so we're gonna stay here i got here it's thursday i got here around two it's five now it's five and then we're gonna have the whole all of tomorrow we're gonna be here and then um, the next day Saturday it's actually supposed to rain um, so I don't know how long I'm gonna stay I haven't booked my ticket back yet but that's what we're doing like I said I haven't been sleeping very well so even though the weather is like astonishingly gorgeous it's beautiful outside um, I feel like a zombie I'm sure any of you guys who suffer with anxiety or anything like that the after effect is almost as bad as being in it um, is that you're just exhausted <laughs> and that's how I feel um, so I'm pretty much just taking a nap trying not to feel bad for not going outside pleasantly surprised I'm going to meet up with my friend Katie so we're gonna get dinner and then tomorrow we're going to be meeting up with the queen of Busan, um, Adrienne, and um, and she's in Seoul today. Like this girl is just, I never know what city she's in. I'm so excited in case I don't capture it well. Adrienne is like the nicest person in the world. So I'm so excited to see her. This is the first time that I'm seeing her where it's not like we're working basically. And then, like I said, Saturday, it's gonna rain. And then I'm gonna go back to Seoul and then we're gonna turn right back around and we're gonna go on another cherry blossom trip. I'm not gonna tell you where just yet. But anyway, that's the plan. That's what's going on. Tomorrow, I'm hoping, is just go, 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 go. So many cherry blossoms. Just pure happiness is what I want. Pure happiness. I listened to so much Beach Boys today. I'm feeling good now. Yeah, so I'm gonna take my little rest and I will see you guys when we get tacos. Yes, okay, bye. <laughs>
Greetings. So I went to go get a donut from this new donut shop that opened nearby and they only had one kind left because it was the end of the day and the guy decided to give me two. So um, I'm gonna eat one and try to fall asleep with all the sugar in my body and we'll see what happens to the next one. So thank you for joining me. That Mexican food, those tacos, delicious. People were so nice. Um, highly recommend them, Rio Verde. And um, yeah, alrighty. I will see you guys in the morning. Oh my. <laughs> everyone that was such a lovely experience so i woke up early and i went to cafe et which is famous in busan because it has these two massive cherry blossom trees as you saw anyway people were so nice like i it was super crowded already like i got there four minutes after it opened and it was packed um because everybody wanted a picture but every because everyone was there for this tree like everyone was so nice and taking pictures for each other and so if you are ever traveling alone um never feel weird if there's like a gr like a popular place to take a picture if you ask somebody to take a picture for you they will and they'll probably take it really well because they already know the angles that they want you know um so anyway lovely i'm gonna cross actually i have like a loose schedule so i'm gonna look at this street what anyway there's some trees i want to see but um yeah it was just a super cute experience and i ran into um a subscriber who lives in busan but is from indonesia and they said hey so it was just like overall a really good morning and we're just gonna walk around and look at cherry blossoms all day so get ready for more of this i'm filled with strawberry juice what more could you ask for
Okay, this spot is so pretty. This is, we're near like Samnap, I think it's pronounced. Um, oh, that's a spider web. I don't know where the spider is. Anyway, um, it's just this walkway, giant walkway lined with cherry blossoms. It's stunning. There are so many bees, but it's okay. There are so many dogs walking. Um, it's just so nice. If you want to, oh, please don't. Um, if you want to like rent a bike or something, I didn't see any bike rentals, but there are just a ton of people on bikes, so it's super bike friendly. Um, these finally came out. Ooh. Oh, it's raining blossoms already. Ah, ah. Um, <laughs> overall, I am just, I could not be happier here. Um, I got really lucky. So let's keep walking around and then, um, ooh, try to catch the blossoms falling, but yeah. <laughs> my last night in Busan and I am up near Dalmachi. This is a street a little past Hyundai um, and it's shaped like a moon so that's why it's called Dalmachi. Um, it has gorgeous cherry blossoms and I'm going to meet up with Adrian. I don't know what we're doing. I know nothing. I just know that we're gonna see each other and the cherry blossoms and I'm fine with just knowing that. So um, I'm gonna go find her. I'm in a literal like forest um, couldn't be more pleased. So let's find her. I'm right on time. Let's go.
So I just got back from sitting and chatting with Adrian for a while and um, I decided on the way home to stop in Hyundai because um, I don't think I'm gonna have time to go to Hyundai tomorrow. Um, but there's this crazy light thing going on. I don't really know, um, but it's very beautiful and it's very large, it's the entire beach. Uh, one really cool thing about Busan is like, I obviously grew up in a beach town. The beach was like, I'm sorry, it's so dark. The beach was like its own separate thing, you know? Um, so here, it's like the buildings come right to the beach. So people are out here at night, it's really cool. Um, but where I'm from, like the beach at night, you don't go. <laughs> It's like dark, there's nothing to do. It's very scary, so maybe I'm just the scared one. But anyway, um, it's so interesting to see all of these people out here. It's like eight o'clock, it's dark, um, but the beach is popping. I absolutely love that. So anyway, Adrian was wonderful as always. Now I'm going to walk to the next subway station and um, I'm gonna head back to my Airbnb um, and then tomorrow is our last day and I'm heading home around 2, so I don't know how much we'll get up to, but um, I'm just going to enjoy Busan as much as I can and um, I'll catch you at the Airbnb. I've literally never seen anything like this before in my entire life, I'm gonna get out of the road. But I have never seen cherry blossoms like this. Like this does not exist in Seoul. I literally, as far as the eye can see in that direction, is just pink. Um, amazing, <laughs> what the heck? This is stunning and this is just, this is just an apartment complex. Literally I think it's just called the Beach Apartments right next to Kwanganni. Um these are massive, they are beautiful, they are arching over the street. I mean, it's like, it's amazing. Um, so stunned by Busan. Like, I love Busan, but I had no idea it went this hard <laughs> for spring. So definitely put Busan on your spring list if it isn't already. Incredible, everything will be linked down below, obviously. Um, I'm stunned, but I'm also hungry, so I'm going to walk through this towards coffee and breakfast. Uh, just breathtaking honestly like cannot capture it on film properly incredible <laughs> Puscucci. There's a bunch of cafes on here um, on this road, but it's very early on a Saturday. I'm, I was really hungry, so I wanted a place to eat, and this was the best option. But 
Yeah, the window is open as I'm sure you can hear. You can probably barely hear me. What a nice trip. I don't care that I'm so dark. I want you to look at the water anyway, but um, this was just a really, a really nice trip. I say this every time I come to Busan. This is my fifth, sixth time here. Um, this city is just so chill. Like I feel so happy here. I'm very, I'm just very pleased. Um, I got to see a lot of people. I didn't expect to see Katie and her sister. Um, so happy that I got to see Adrian. Um, it was just, it's been a great, a great time. So I'll probably leave you here. Honestly, there's not, oh no, you know what? I'm going somewhere else. No, I'm saying my goodbyes prematurely. We do have one more stop. I'm sorry. Um, so I will see you before the train. Um, and then after that, literally, I'm coming home and we're turning around and we're gonna go to another city. And you can try and guess that in the comments. I might have already posted about it on Instagram, so you might know. Yeah, I'm going to finish my book. I'm sorry, it's so noisy, but you don't need to listen to me anyway. Um, I'm gonna finish my book and finish my pizza, my morning pizza, and uh, my coffee. We're gonna try to get back on the coffee game. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy everything and see you in a bit. to my soccer team they're playing today good luck team rooting for both sides We have reached the end of our trip. I am just walking through Samyun or like the Junpo area. I'm gonna hop on a bus, gonna get to Busan Station, gonna go back to Seoul. It's apparently raining there already, which sucks because I guess the cherry blossoms came out in Seoul like basically today. I hope they hold on um, and I hope that they hold on in our next location as well. So anyway, like I said, gonna head to the station. That Naive Brewers was super cute, but it was just so funny. That cat was so unfriendly, but everyone wanted to love it. And so we all bonded over the fact that the cat would not acknowledge us <laughs> unless it was like to bat us away. So it was cute. Like the people in there were very nice. Um, so I will see you guys on our next trip. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the spring vibes. Time to go listen to Taylor Swift on a train. Love it.